<laughs> That's Dennis Johnson. The first time he touched the ball this year, he took it coast to coast on a kick return for a touchdown. Georgia did likewise last week with the longest play in Sanford Stadium history on a kick return for a score as well against South Carolina. Walsh with a kick and we're underway in Fayetteville. Dennis Johnson backpedals two yards deep. He won't bring this one out. Rolls to throw and got a man wide open. It's Michael Smith on the run and he's got a first down. Just like that, trying to get Ryan Mallett for this season. Mallett at third and 15. Here they come again. He's just got to get rid of this one. Jeff Owens came right up the middle, and Ryan Mallett was backpedaling as quickly as he could. Yeah, and it looked like Ryan... Looked behind breathing. And in this case, not a bad kick, but might be returnable. Miller, and he fumbled it, and I think Arkansas has got it. First mistake of the night. Out of the eye and the toss to Johnson with a blocker in front. And he does a nice job of picking up five or six yards. Second down at four. They move the tight end Williams and play fake and throw. Want to throw to him. And now to the end zone instead. Touchdown. Joe Adams. And came away with six. Alex Tejada for the point after, and it's up and good. First touchdown. The crowd trying to make it difficult for him. And here's his first pass. Cox, deep. Got a man, and it's A.J. Green. Big throw and out of bounds at the 26-yard line. Pick up of 29. Green at the bottom, right by the two. To the end zone, touchdown. Aaron White to tight end. And Joe Cox throws a strike, 21 yards for the score. Gary Franklin, but never knew where the ball was. Blair Walsh, extra point is up and good. A chance to return the first one. He will get a chance at this one. From the two. Johnson. And around. On the reverse. Kobe Hamilton. Look out. Hamilton. All the way down into Georgia territory. We saw them run. freshman out of Texarkana, Texas, as is the quarterback, Ryan Mallett, who's back to throw. Wants it all. Deep. Got a man. Touchdown, Darius Wright. Tejada <laughs> in for the point after. High snap, but they got it down, and the kick is up and good. That's for sure. Second down and three. Again, Samuel, and he's going to have a first down. You know, Joe Cox was telling us, I just like hard on Joe Cox in the shotgun on third down and eight. He's going to go deep down on the sideline, and incomplete to Lars King was the intended receiver. Nice coverage by up against the rules. Ryan Mallett from his own goal line. Deep ball near sideline for Childs, and he got it. Greg Childs made a great catch on the sideline. Well, it's only happened once with Jeff Owens. Here they come with an extra man. Mallett steps up in the pocket and he got hit. Right. Down comes the ball. George has got it. Ready Curran, I think, is the guy. So just when I said they hadn't been able to get to him, he sidestepped in the pocket. Play action. Cox, deep slant, A.J. Green. Inside the 25 to the 23. And another nice throw. Pick up a beat. Third down and six. Joe Cox in the shotgun. Across the middle, knocked down by Wendell Davis. And that was intended for Aaron. His kick on the way. Oof, it was close. Tucked it inside the right upright from 35 and a for his quarterback. Second down at five. This time, George is going to wrap up. The tailback for a loss of a couple of we check in again with Reese Davis. Reese, what do you got? Colbert. First down at the 36. Samuel lost the ball. Adrian Davis has got it. The 
It just looked like Samuel took his eye off the football. It was just a toss to the field down between the 35 and the 30-yard line. In this case, actually the 29. Mallett might want it all on the first play again. To the corner. Oh, what a catch. in their own part of the field. They've done that in all three of their games. And the extra point is good. George has got to be careful here. They can't afford another turnover. Cox is all day to throw. Man in the middle. It's intercepted. By Tremaine Thomas. Field. Good position for the defense. They just come with a three-man rush. Mallett steps up. Now he's going to run with it, or is he? And he's going to slide. Rennie Curran got over there, so did Justin Houston. Second down, 20. Here's a big opening for Samuel. He might be gone. Richard Samuel. Touchdown, Georgia. 80 yards. <laughs> Looking for a ground game. Hello. They just found one. Well, I think they really fooled the Arkansas defense. Extra point by Walsh. He's up and good. Georgia strikes on the 20-yard line. Mallett steps up. Pressure from behind. He throws short and drilled. Kobe Hamilton down there by Caleb King flanking Joe Cox in the gun. He got a nice block, and the pass is more on a crossing pattern. And it's a first down for Georgia out to the 48-yard line. They're kind of looking for that other guy in the city here. Georgia on the drive, but trailing. Caleb King again, and King into the secondary, and he's got a first down to the 39-yard line. Pick up of 11. So Caleb King, who hasn't played highly touted high school defense here. Green, the motion man. Georgia will keep it on the ground. Caleb King is not going to get it this time. So now it looks like Georgia will have to attempt. Up. They are going for it. Joe Cox with time across the middle, and Moore's got it, and a first down. Again, the crossing pattern to number 82, the senior who's been there. They've been doing a good job running the ball, but here they're going to pass again. Cox across the middle, complete A.J. Green to the corner. Touchdown. There's the big play, man. 25 yards on a crossing pattern, and the dogs are taking the lead. Safety is really no help either. Blair Walsh's extra point is up and good. They have his own goal line. Not a great kick. Might take a good bounce. Nope, it doesn't do that either. And it rolls out of bounds. Georgia's got a timeout left. Down at 19 after the sack. Cox, look out from behind. He got away. Throws deep in the middle. Got his man. It's A.J. Green. And now the question that Todd just asked is, but that's a first down. The clock will stop. Here they come running. The, the points. Walsh will try the from 37. Is from 37 yards, and he's got it right down Dixon Street. So Georgia gets a huge added through. Arkansas has not converted a third down tonight. They're 0 for 5. Mallett stands tall, and he delivers this one, and it's Williams again for the first down. Right at midfield. So they got a broken collarbone, or he'd be out there getting reps as wide receiver. Two guys with broken collarbones, and you understand Michael Floyd of Notre Dame, I think, reset on one of the uh, four weeks ago. There's the quarterback, and he got plenty. Kind of dug in behind his center. And his left guard, and he got it easily. Down to the bottom. Pump fake. Childs down the sideline, and he's got it, and he's gone. Brandon Boykin just couldn't to try to give Arkansas the lead. And he does. 28-27. The Hogs hold on. And the shotgun. Throws deep middle. Got a man. It's Moore again. And another great catch by Michael Moore. 21 yards. He is not afraid to go down the middle, is he? No. And it's for Georgia first down. 
Cox loads and goes deep. Out there, and it's caught. Tavares King for the touchdown. 50-yard strike. Joe Cox to Tavares King. The long extra point by Blair Walsh. And he's got it up and good. Well, Georgia would have had a sick now. 34-28, Georgia. Well, Willie Martinez doesn't have any. Well, that's true. Here's Malik, play fake. Lobs one out, and diving catch by the other number four on the offensive bike. Jared is right. And you see Georgia, but Arkansas back in dog territory. Here's a throwback to a guy who's wide open. It's D.J. Williams at the 30, the 20. He might go. Williams out of bounds at about the two. 40 more yards through the air. D.J. Williams at tight end will move. There's the play fake. There's the throw, and there's the touchdown to the tight end. A new school record. In touchdown passes by Ryan Mallett. Important point after. South Carolina missed one last week. They know how important they are. He knocks it in the right upright. Still back for the first time in quite some time. They fake it to him. Joe Cox deep middle again and complete again into Arkansas territory to Orson Charles, the freshman tight end. Here, these dogs are trailing by one. Joe Cox trying to change that. Going deep. Got a man. They're in the front again. Touchdown. <laughs> oh, Orson Charles back-to-back -back catches for the freshman tight end. And nobody home in the middle of the field. Richard Samuel, the tailback split as a third wide receiver. Cox to the corner to Green. And he's got him. Two-pointer. You might as well chalk that up. <laughs> We, we got 20 minutes of serious football left. Mallet stands tall and throws low, but Joe Adams made the catch. Again, Mallet under. On the Arkansas side of the 50 for the Razorbacks. Here's the toss. Smith almost stumbled on his own. Regained his footing, and he got the corner. And he got pummeled out of bounds, but he got a first down. As we head down to three minutes in the third quarter, Georgia in front, 42-35. Mallet trying to change it, and he might right here. Out of bounds, Childs made the catch in a touchdown saving tackle by Brian Evans to knock him out of zone is uh, not out of the question for sure. Mallett got some pressure through to Williams on a crossing route, and the tight end got it, and the ball came out at the end, but I think they had blown it dead at the six-yard line. Georgia, three-yard attempt to try to cut into Georgia's lead. And the kick is up and good. So more scoring. And try to run the clock some and, and get some physicality going. This guy's been physical. The wide receiver, Michael Moore. Moore on a spin and out to the 48-yard line. And another Jordan Sensational's in a slot on the right-hand side. They found him in the middle a lot tonight. This time it's his throw to King, though, and he wheels, and he's got the first down and then some. Tavares King, and that quiets the crowd. A pin and five plus the inches. Joe Cox going to load and go to the corner. Touchdown, A.J. Green. Wow. Five touchdown passes for both quarterbacks. And that throw is put in the only spot it can be put. Blair Walsh is up and good. Georgia has struck. They'll have their hands full with the passing game of Arkansas. We can probably tell you that much. Here's Ryan Mallett loading and firing far side. Again, a strike to Adams. And again, that long throw all the way to the other side of over 400 yards passing just by himself in this game at some point. Not here. Michael Smith. He almost snapped it out of there. He got nine yard yardage. Hasn't been their best friend. Let's see if they get it here. It's Smith. And he got it. And he popped out of there. Michael Smith. Weaving his way down to the 12-yard line. Best run of the night by the little guy. How much? Down right here, although it's two downs all the way, I'm sure, for the Arkansas Razorbacks. Mallet in trouble. He got away. He's going to slide short of the first down by about three. So it's fourth down, and the first down would come. Zahada hit a 23-yarder earlier, and he's going to try one from the right hash, and he's got it. So the field goal. Joe Cox with pressure. Deep sideline. Nobody over there except his Bulldog teammates at his fourth down. 
Nice defensive stand by the zone end zone. And deep down the middle, incomplete again. This might be the last down of the ball game for AJ Green, the motion man. It'll be Caleb King. And King, he breaks three. Caleb King's got it all the way down to the 11 yard line. Almost busted it for a touchdown. He. And they're just going to get it in position for Blair Walsh to try to kick a field goal that had probably put it out of reach. Football, but what a leader and what poor. Blair Walsh just got it in the upright, and Joe Cox knows right now that it's going to take. Malik steps up and goes deep on the sideline incomplete, and it might be the last down behind him. That was last week. Malik down the middle on the crossing route, and this time he completes it to Michael Smith, but it's not enough, and it's too late. And with 59 tough weeks, and he came out smelling like a rose tonight, that's for sure. Georgia wins on the road in a thrilling SEC battle on ESPN between the Razorbacks and the Bulldogs. The Dogs, at least tonight, top the Hogs. Good show by both teams and a whole...